Hey everybody, it's Nick from Android Headlines, and we're here at the Synaptics booth checking out Vivo's incredible breakthrough, a fingerprint scanner inside the glass. OEMs have been trying to do it for years, it seems, but Vivo is the first one to absolutely nail the technology, and it's all powered by this little chip by Synaptics. You may not be familiar with the Synaptics name, or Vivo for that matter, but both of them are likely bigger than you might imagine. Synaptics touchscreen digitizers are likely in every phone you've probably ever used, and Vivo is one of the biggest Chinese OEMs out there. In our testing, this method worked perfectly, but it has a few caveats right now. First off, it's got to be in an OLED screen, something that's not really a problem for flagships that have been moving to OLEDs for years, of course, but it's likely not going to be on more budget-minded phones for a while. Second, it can only be used when the screen is on. This isn't really a big deal either, as the always-on display you see here wakes up the fingerprint sensor as soon as you pull it out of a pocket or pick it up from a table. And of course, many phones with front-mounted fingerprint scanners require you to press the home button before it even works anyway. It's pretty seamless, and while it's not quite as elegant as facial recognition might be, it's certainly more practical for many, many reasons. Here's hoping this is a huge breakthrough year for such things. Check out our other CES 2018 coverage here on YouTube, and don't forget to check out AndroidHeadlines.com for 24-7 tech news coverage. Thanks for watching, and until next time.